Okay, people, it's time to play OC Trivia Live right here on YouTube. We have a very fun trivia round for you. Here's how you play. Get some paper and a pen, write down one through 10, because there's 10 questions. Watch this video to play this quiz. Pause the video if you need more time to think about the answer, but only give yourselves an extra 30 seconds max. Do not cheat, don't look up the answers online. You get 10 points for each correct answer, but you don't lose points if you get a wrong answer, so don't do that to yourself. Post your score in the comments below when you're finished. String four to six of these video quizzes together if you wanna play a complete game, like start off with a general knowledge, do a picture, do a history, do a sports, and then do a final round. That would be a lot of fun, wouldn't it? All right, this is gonna be general knowledge, Final round number four. So this is our fourth final round that I've produced. Let's get started. Here's number one. Which classic rock band released the album The Wall in 1979? Moving on. That's how fast we go. So if you need to pause, feel free. Here's number two. People with look Latromesia, latromesia, hate which profession? Lawyers, doctors, house inspectors, or exterminators? Moving on to number three. In Disney's The Sword and the Stone, what object is the sword magically stuck inside? How about number four? Here we go. Isabel Perón became the first female president of a country in 1974 for which country? Here's number five. Chun Kuk Do is a martial arts style created by which actor was it? Jean-Claude Van Damme, Bruce Lee, Jackie Chan, or Chuck Norris? Which one? Folks, we're moving on to question number six, and it is... In Shakespeare's A Midsummer Night's Dream, Titania is queen of the what? Queen of the what? Let's move on to number seven. What is the middle name of US President Donald Trump? What is his middle name? All right, folks, we're moving on to number eight. This one is, which singer had solo hits titled Fields of Gold and If I Ever Lose My Faith in You? Name the singer. Once again, you can pause the video if you need a little more time to think about it, but don't give yourselves more than 30 seconds. Here's number nine. Which mobile phone app was the most used app in 2017? Let's move on to number 10, you guys. Here's your final question. And of course, since this is a final round, this question is worth a lot of points. 80 points. So there's eight correct answers. You may have to flip your sheet over or get another answer sheet. Here is your final question. What are the top eight best-selling board games in history? We'll leave it going for another 20 seconds here. Feel free to pause if you need more time. Now's the time to pause the video if you need more time because now, here 
come the answers to this round. Number one was... Which classic rock band released the album The Wall in 1979? The name of that band? Pink Floyd. That's right, The Wall. An extremely depressing <laughs> album. Number two. People with latromesia hate which profession? They do not like doctors. I know a lot of people with latromesia. Number three. In Disney's The Sword in the Stone, what object is the sword magically stuck in? It's not a stone. Yes, kind of a trick question. It's an anvil. It's sitting on a stone. It looks like that. See the anvil? Here's number four. Isabel Perón became the first female president of a country in 1974. For which country? Well, it was Argentina. That's right. The first female president of any country was in South America. Number five. Chun Kuk Do is a martial arts style created by which actor? Chuck Norris. That's right. Chuck Norris had his own martial art and he was built he built a hospital he was born in. Here's number six. In Shakespeare's A Midsummer's Night's Dream, Titania is queen of the what? Titania is queen of the fairies in that particular tale. Number seven. What is the middle name of U.S. President Donald Trump? His middle name starts with a J, and it's John, Donald John Trump. And number eight, which singer had solo hits titled Fields of Gold and If I Ever Lose My Faith in You? The singer comes from the band The Police, and his name is Sting. That's right. And number nine, which mobile phone app was the most used app in 2017? It makes logical sense that it was the Facebook app. Facebook, very, very popular website and app. And number 10, the final question, your eight best-selling board games in the history of the world are number one, chess. Yes, there are some basic, basic games on here. Number two, checkers. Number three, backgammon. Did you think about that one? Old, old game. Number four, Scrabble. Now we're getting into the newer games. Number five, Monopoly, of course. Number six, Clue, still very popular. Number seven, Othello, which I've never played, but black and white uh, dots, black and white pieces. And uh, number eight is Trivial Pursuit. Those are your top eight. And wrapping up the top 10, Pictionary was number nine, Risk at number 10. All right, you guys, tally up your scores from all your games. Add them up, see who won, post your score in the comments, tell me what games you strung together if you played a whole game. Like and share and subscribe, test your friends with these videos. Thanks for playing you guys, you can also find OC Trivia on Facebook, we'll see you at the next game.